Good morning once again. Just before I turn it back to your uh, leaders, a couple of quick uh, kudos. Uh, varsity boys basketball team hosted an impressive tournament over the weekend filled with uh, some of the best teams in the province. Uh, the boys played very, very well, finishing with a bronze in their own tournament against some really good competition. So well done, Mr. Shaddock and boys, and of course the manager, Ms. Matthew. Uh, boys hockey team was also out in Winkler, did very well against some top-level competition again. So congrats on that excellent performance and well done to both teams and their coaches for continuing to uh, develop some excellence in uh, athletic uh, learning and behaving. Over to your illustrious leaders. Good morning, Buckeyes. Our names are Ariel and Kaylin. And today is Monday, January 24, uh, 14th, and it is a day two. Over to Miss Matthews students for a few announcements. Last reminder that tomorrow is Miss Matthews grade nine readings, thinking class will be collecting socks. So be sure to bring them in to collect more grade points. See you tomorrow. Attention Buckeyes, the Global Issue students have a few projects happening on Wednesday. Wear a hat to school day for a dollar donation, bake sale and used sporting goods collection for sports kid, and traditional food from Ghana being sold by the office at lunch. All profits go to Salo Mission. Come by and support these important causes. As well, Benjamin Mensa and Pedro Proano would like to tell you that they will also be hosting a fundraiser on Wednesday, January 16th in the tunnel at lunch. They will be selling West African dishes such as jollof rice and fried plantain. All proceeds will be going to Slow Mission and their efforts to conquer homelessness in the city of Winnipeg. They also are looking for winter essential donations to take to Salom Mission as well, such as hats and gloves. If you donate winter clothing, the meal will be $4, regular price being $5. Thanks again. It will take place on Wednesday, January 16th at lunch. If you have any questions, please contact Benjamin Mensa or Pedro Rolano. Attention grade 12 students need help applying to university. Come to room 12 Wednesday, January 16th at lunch. Attention all students, Flying Pizza fundraiser is happening every Tuesday and Friday at lunch until the end of semester one classes. Where? In front of the theater. Why? To raise money for the refugees living in flooded out camps in Syria. 100% of the profits will go directly to providing blankets, warm clothes, boots, and firewood for the for them. One slice is two fifty and two slices plus a drink is five dollars. Hope to see you there on Tuesday to help us support this important cause. Attention England and Scotland travelers. This is a reminder that there is a meeting scheduled for tonight, but it has been cancelled. And in sports news, attention ringette players. If you are interested in participating in this year's high school ringette tournament, at the end of April, please sign up outside of Student Services. You will find more information located there. Congrats to all of the track and field athletes that completed in the Indoor Track and Field Championship Series meet number one at, universe, at the University of Manitoba on Thursday, January 10th. A special shout out goes out to the following athletes that had top 12 finish, finishes. The top 12 finishers at the end of the series for each event will qualify for the championship meet in March. So congrats to the following students for the track event. For JV girls, 60 meters, Tina, Tiana Gunn, varsity girls, 60 meters, Alicia Rubens, JV boys, 150, uh, 150 meters, Daniel DeBricky, varsity boys, 60 meters, Jordan Sufi, varsity boys, 15,000, uh, Brandon Spilnick, and for field events, JV Boys, Shop Put, and Ethan Macario. And we have two bucks to call the office. Can Eduardo Rodriguez, Guisu, and Stan Hankivix please come to the office? That's all for today, Buckeyes. Have a great day making a positive difference. Yeah, I was like.